Hello YouTube. We have a pretty good one today with uh, with Jonas. I'll just put my strap there. Uh -huh. Okay. And then I'll keep one line uh, overhead. So by the time that I put this one put, yeah, put it to the bottom. I'll keep it up here just to release some tension and pull it over with right me. At the bottom. Yeah, that's fine okay. right there. Um, which line you gonna use? I'm gonna use a low sheet line. And then one of the top ones. No, what it's I'm probably gonna use uh, most likely the the blue one. Why don't you do the big one will be I'm gonna keep one on top. Yeah. Yeah. So use the blue one. And blue one to pull. Okay. Watch your head. Go up. Okay. Yeah, you can take that off. The blue one. Yeah, this is a blue one. Yeah. Yeah, with the shackle. You want shackle? Oh, you want to bring the shackle? Yeah, bring the shackle. I'm for that shock over here. Hold that. That one up there. There you go. Watch your legs, Jonas. Just to keep you guys up to speed, uh, it's like on a little hill, and this container, when it rolled, started sliding down the little hill onto the opposing, uh, the neighboring yard. So what we're gonna do is uh, basically low sheave it and start sliding it up towards us before we start rigging. So I keep a low sheave line at the bottom to drag it up, and I'm gonna keep a, a line on top to reduce the tension, just control it as I'm bringing it up. Oh, right on top. Yeah, on that one. No, that one. Okay. We'll rig after, once we bring it up.
Right behind you, Jonas. Which one? Either or, no matter. Put the other one better. The other one. There you go. Yeah, I wanna re ring him on the bottom. So uh, put it. Yeah. So just to show you where where we're at obviously I started sliding down here you can see right there where it's uh, starting to slide so obviously it's secured now so that way it won't slide any further in onto the neighboring property which looks like it belongs to a Ralph's a grocery store dale, dale. yeah put one another one You gotta put it on a low line. You, want to like this, right? you could put it down here. I would probably put it to the frame, to be honest with you. Yeah. On the frame. On the frame, whatever. Put it on the bottom, as well as possible. You think from the frame, from the chest? Yeah. On the way to the frame, but this. Yeah, down there, just around the frame. Any more? Here. Okay, go for it. Right there. Good. What happened? Oh, you ran out on your line.
there. So I guess he had ran out of line. I'll just wait for him to catch up. Right now? I'm just went over there to talk to you. Yeah. The problem is, is that right here, you're, you're pretty much, you already pushed it out as far as you can. You ran out of cable. Yeah. Uh, I want to move the truck out of the way. Yeah, that, yeah. This, yep. Your truck alone could do that one. Like yeah. You don't, you don't need to, you don't need this truck in the middle. He can move forward. I can. I can move if you want. Let me push it up a little bit further up this way. Watch out. Watch out. Let me get it up here so I can disconnect. That way he could get out of the way. Okay, perfect. Okay. That's good. There's no more tension on it. Just disconnect from here. I'll move forward and then just go off that way. Hold on. Right. Yeah. You guys aren't gonna need me anymore? No. Nope. Okay. Alex, I want to keep you the original one. I don't hit the button there. Well, you're going to have to disconnect, no? Okay. That's why. All right. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, I might still use it. I don't okay. know. Hey, how you doing?
well as you can see here you could uh i already have the hooked uh the top hooked up i'm just gonna put attention on my lines yeah let me put attention on my lines attention on my line so the, the game plan here right now if you, as you saw we uh we pretty much uh ended up uh, sliding up uh, the, the the tractor i'm gonna put tension on my other lines and as i lift it's gonna pretty much bring up uh So I play with the cable, so as I uh, apply tension to my, uh, my wrench winch line, I apply uh, pressure to the green one. Gotta wait on uh, on Jonas to bring it towards him. So I have my portion in the air ready. There's, uh, you keep pulling. It's gonna, it's gonna yank it towards you, Jonas. Yeah. Let me, let me leave it right there. I'll, I'll yank it towards me. You want to bring it closer? You want to leave it there? You want to upright it there? Yeah. Can you upright it right there? Yeah. I have to disconnect from the other line. What? I have to run a, a line from the opposite side, Jonas. Huh? Are you going to be able to upright it right there? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Okay. Let me connect the line here then. You can control the catches a lot. Huh? Yeah, because I have the bottom.
could leave that one right there actually. Are you ready? Horse. The light snapped. You can back up to it, right? Yeah. Why don't Why don't you be perpendicular to it? So by the time that you start that you start picking up, it's gonna swing it out towards you. So if you move forward and you put your truck somewhere right here, you'll be fine. Okay. Now the other one. Hold it. I'm gonna help you. I'm gonna attach a line to the bottom. Okay? I'm gonna help you. I'm gonna put one of my lines to the bottom so I can winch it over to help it to help it uh, even out. Go ahead and lift with the other one. The other one. Go ahead, go ahead, just keep going. Keep going, I know, keep going. I'll, I'll, I know where to push. Keep going. No, keep going, you'll, you'll see. See how, see how the load's shifting? Okay, go ahead and do it again. That's fine. Keep putting on more pressure. It's time to find. Hold it right there. Okay. Okay, a little bit more pressure. Go ahead and boom up a little bit. I need pressure off with the with the green cable. See? Hold it right there. Hold it right there. Right there, should be fine for you, right? Yeah, okay. Go ahead and release tension then. So now we have uh, the unit pretty much in line. Clipper's pretty much ready to upright. So is uh, Jonas. We're gonna start pulling it over. Are you good right there? Or you wanna run a chain from the bottom up, right? Okay, let's do that. As you can see where it was all the way down at the bottom right here. Well, halfway down. You can see the indent of the container. So I have my straps pretty much in line. And Jonas is going to go down to the back and install one of his. And start uh, uprighting it. But the important thing is, is that we secured the load up here where we could uh, do our magic. And start uprighting.
Ready? Hold on. You want to put your landing gear down? Go ahead. Oh, I guess. It's... Put the landing gear down, yeah, Jonas. Yes, sir. Let's put it down. So Jonas is gonna pretty much uh, put the landing gear down. It's stabilized. Oh, you can see it, it's all bowed out. So hopefully the load is not shifted, but who knows how they, it came over. But it's all bowed out. You see that damage right there? That looks like it's from uh Let's get down. How do you see oh, it? Shit. 
It's Look at the bulge. Yeah, that's pulled out because of that. Look at the bulge. Well, what's in it? I don't know. We're gonna figure it out. Okay, but you can hook it up and take it back to the sack. Yeah, they get a back right here so they can take it back. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and disconnect, put my outriggers away, and move the truck forward so he could uh, basically uh, dock it. So we'll see right now. What happened? I'm not holding it. So Jonas is basically gonna hold up the, the rear of the container while this guy uh, hooks up. The load looks uh, relatively stable, but just for uh, safety precautions, to uh, hold it while he hooks up just to stabilize a little bit. I guess originally that's what happened is that. This driver tried to hook up from it on the side and it uh, kind of teeter-tottered a little bit and then it went over. drivers that told me that he was backing up under it but uh, this guy actually saw what he what happened is that he was already hauling it away and uh, he didn't uh, check his uh, he didn't do his tuck test so as he was coming around the grade right here it came off uh, his fifth wheel and uh, pretty much uh, landed on the ground and boom went over with all that momentum What happened? Oh, your chain? It, it was at the bottom. Well, guys, I'm just gonna pretty much put away my stuff now. Jonas is pretty much done. I'm gonna grab all my all my rigging and uh, my one chain. And 
and uh, call it a day. This guy's just gonna put his landing gear up and uh, back it up into the dock so they could offload it. Alright guys, from uh, Arson, California, pretty much done. Peace out guys.